Hey guys, what's up? I am back with the brand new video and it's time to do ASP test comparison between the Samsung Galaxy A72 versus the Poco F3. And guys, and the Poco F3 is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 870 processor with the 8 GP of RAM, while the Samsung Galaxy A72 is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 720G chipset with the 8 GP of RAM. On the back, we got the triple cameras on the Poco F3. While on the A72, we have a quad cameras on the back. We have 64 megapixel main camera with optical image stabilization on the A72. While on the Poco F3, we get a 48 megapixel main camera. And guys, I'm really, really excited to see that how is the Samsung Galaxy A72 with the mid-range chipset is stack up against the Poco F3, which has the flagship chipset. So without any wasting time, let's get right into it. And guys, and both phones is completely off. Now let's see the boot up test. Here we go. And the logo is here more faster on the Samsung Galaxy A72. And guys, and both phones is running on Android 11. We have a Samsung MIUI version 3.1, while on the Poco F3 we have a MIUI version 12.5. And Samsung Galaxy logo. And you can see, and guys, and the Poco F3 is also support 5G as well. And you can see on the Poco F3, it is a super, super fast phone when it comes to booting up. And now the Samsung Galaxy A72, it is also done. And you can see about four or five second difference between these two devices when it comes to booting up. And guys, you can see that on both phones has a very similar display. We have a Full HD Super AMOLED display with 90 Hz refresh rate on the A72. While on the Poco F3, we get a Full HD AMOLED display with 120 hertz refresh rate and also we get a center punch hole on both phones which looks exactly the same as you can see so now let's see the app's opening speed and guys everything is closed up in the background and you can see no application is running in the background so now let's see phone dialer on both phones that is a little bit more faster on the samsung galaxy a72 as compared to the poco f3 so next on the list is the settings on both phones and that is looks exactly the same and you can see so now let's go to the display on both phones and you can see we have 90 hertz refresh rate on the a72 while on the poco f3 we get a 120 hertz refresh rate now let's check out some more application now let's see amazon shopping and that is super super faster on the a72 and you can see f3 is take a little bit more time so now let's see the scrolling and that is fees more smoother on the Poco F3 again we have 120 Hertz as compared to 90 Hertz refresh rate so now let's see some games application now let's see that how much a difference between a Snapdragon 720G versus a Snapdragon 870 which also support 5G as well let's see Candy Crush Saga faster and you can see super super on the Poco F3 as compared to the Samsung Galaxy A72 and guys we also have a dual speakers which is really really good on the Poco F3 Instagram that is exactly the same let's see pin out faster on the Poco F3 as compared to the S72 let's see snapchat faster on the Poco F3 let's see Spotify and faster on the Poco F3 in, as you can see but at the end A72 faster there let's see subway suffer And that is again huge faster on the Poco F3 and the A72. Now it is also done. Let's see Temper and 2. Last game application we have in the speed test again more faster on the Poco F3. And you can see huge faster there, which which is obvious because we have a Snapdragon 870 processor versus a Snapdragon 720G faster on the Poco F3. And now the A72, it is also done. Now let's opening up the tutor and faster little bit on the a72 zedge and faster on the poco f3 little bit more faster there not a huge difference so now let's see the scrolling again more smoother on the poco f3 again no lag whatsoever we have 90 hertz as compared to 120 hertz so last time i launched the cameras on both phones default camera app now let's see that who is going to be the fastest one. Again, we have 48 megapixel main camera as compared to 64 megapixel main camera. Let's see camera application. Faster on the Poco F3 
as compared to the A72 and gas. And the A72 also has a 8 megapixel 3x optical zoom, which is not really available on the Poco F3. So guys, now let's see internet bound speed. I am using default Google Chrome on both phones. So now let's see wikipedia.org faster on the Poco F3 as compared to the A72. So now let's see the scrolling again, more smoother on the Poco F3 as compared to the A72 again, no lag whatsoever on both phones. So now let's open this faster on the Poco F3 as compared to the A72. So now let's see the scrolling again, more smoother on the Poco F3, but again, no lag whatsoever on both phones. And guys, the next on the list is the apple.com and faster on the F3 as compared to the A72. Let it move faster there. So now let's see the scrolling again, really smooth on both phones. Again, we have 120 here, so it is feels a little bit more smoother on the A72, but again, not a huge difference in my opinion between a 90 Hertz and a 120 Hertz, but again, more better on the Poco F3. So guys, now let's see RAM management on both phones. Again, we have 8 GB of RAM on both phones. We have a Samsung One UI on the A72, while on the F3, we have a MIUI version 12.5. So now let's see phone dialer, no refresh. Let's see settings no refresh amazon shopping and it is a in-app refresh let's see candy crush saga no refresh instagram no refresh let's see pin out no refresh let's see snapchat let's see spotify no refresh let's see subway surfer no refresh let's see temper and two let's see tutor no refresh zedge same zed and last way back to the internet browser where we left and you can see and gas over I have to say regarding the app's opening speed as you can see that and the Poco F3 is performed more faster as compared to the Samsung Galaxy A72 but you can see that in system based application as well as in the social media application and cast on both phones is performed exactly the same but you can see that in game map during time and the F3 it is always more faster as compared to the A72. In terms of the RAM edge wise and both phones is performed really good in the RAM management so no issue whatsoever. So that's about it and thank you so much for watching this speed test comparison between the Samsung Galaxy A72 versus the Poco F3. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos and follow me on instagram and twitter as well and i will see you in my next video peace out